So we got Expendables coming out in theaters this week, so why not start off my review series with the film that got me into Shinedown. What's going on everybody? Welcome to the channel. We're going to be starting off my review series for the Expendables leading up to Expendables and really this was my first time watching this movie. It wasn't one of those films that I had to rush out and see immediately mostly because by the time this movie came out I was more invested in Step Up 3D than I was in the Expendables. But this movie is made by 80s and 90s action stars for 80s and 90s action fans and that's exactly what you get with this movie because really when you have Stallone, Statham, Lee, Lundgren, Randy Couture, Cold Stone Steve Austin, Terry Crews, and Mickey Rourke, you're not really going into this movie for the plot. You're really going into this movie just to watch Sylvester Stallone and friends kick ass. And even though this movie is titled The Expendables, you can easily just title this movie Stallone and Friends Kicking Ass. The action sequences in this movie are well handled even though they are chopped up at times to pieces and it feels like a Taken 3 movie. You're really going into this movie just to watch people get blown up and you have so much fun. Everybody that grew up in the 80s and 90s, this is the type of movie that they would have loved to see in the 80s and 90s just watching a lot of guys just kick so much ass and this movie is filled with testosterone to the brain because there is a great action sequence in the beginning and then the end battle is absolutely fantastic just watching a lot of people get shot blown up everything that happens in that final act is absolutely fantastic however everything that happens after the beginning of the film up until the beginning of the end of the film is just downtime and there's really not much going on there is a love story that they shoehorned into this movie that really came out of nowhere and really didn't fit or they at least they tried to add that in there but this is just 80s camp type of movie if you were waiting for a movie like this you absolutely got it with the expendables because it is a a lot of fun just to watch a lot of guys kick so much ass and really if you're going into this movie expecting Shakespeare and great acting you're going to be very disappointed with this movie because you don't get any of that this movie is not made to change your world it might encourage you to hit the gym a little bit more but it will not change your life in the slightest but those are my thoughts on the expendables are you guys a fan of this series and what is your favorite action films from the 80s and 90s go ahead and drop your thoughts in the comments below and I'll catch you guys for the expendables too